Hey everybody, you are looking at some ice formations that I shared pictures of on every social media that we're part of, except YouTube. So, since they are back this morning, I want to share them with you. When I posted these pictures online and asked everybody, what is this? I had, uh, let's just say, a lot of interesting responses. Of course, I told everybody in the website article that I wrote that they looked a lot like some kind of fungus because it looks like just a long stem with a little bit of a bloom on the top. But in reality, this is a large red clay dirt pile that we had delivered onto our property for fill dirt. And this is the only place that it's coming out of. And it is indeed ice. If I grab this, I don't know if you're going to be able to tell it very well. Let me take off my gloves here. And I can assure you how cold that is. And I can assure you that it is slowly melting into water. So let me see if I can't warm it up here really quick. So in doing a lot of research, one of the uh, advice that I was given was that this was a phenomenon known as needle ice or ice needles and I believe that was the correct um, there's not even gonna be enough water in there you go that's all it was water and clay now known as mud anyway apparently the uh, brief science behind it is just that the red clay and uh, the way that the formation of the clay is and then some science behind the warm air of the soil and the cold air causes the water to be drawn out. Uh, they call it a capillary action. And as it comes out and hits the cold air, it freezes and causes these little ice formations. And I've had a lot of people tell me that it's common where they come from. Uh, they were plenty more familiar with it. They didn't really know what to call it. Um, but... They were familiar with it but to me this is kind of like my wife living in southern california and then moving to colorado for school and experiencing snow which i know she experienced snow before then but i'm trying to make a point and uh i just think it's one of those things that the first time you see it you just have to marvel at nature and the interesting things that are done so there's a lot of things that are similar to this. This is not just your regular old ice heave. Um, this is also not a frost flower, uh, which are really pretty, and I hope we have them on the property at some point so I can take pictures. Uh, frost flowers literally come off of the vegetation and form like wisps of ice around it, which look like flowers. But this is just ice needles. And I say just, there's not very much information out there about them. But it's really interesting, these little individual strands of ice that almost bond together. And you can just break them apart. But, look at that. How cool is that? Well, anyway, I came outside to shoot some uh, permaculture videos, so let me get on with that. Thank you all for watching.